Welcome to my life as an NPC, I am Carbon Scythe and we're going to play being a dick in just a few seconds but before that I wanted to go through a small thing before we continue with the video. Uh, so in the last video I did ask uh, if you want me to kiss uh, Sage or not and go further with that and I got exactly one response. No judgment, just saying that uh, uh, I, the reason I am asking this is because I want more uh, activity in in the community basically uh, but I did get one response I will put it in the video and uh, on top of that uh, I do get a good enough amount of views I do enjoy the numbers I see there but the number of views is not all there is to it uh, if we look at this uh, last one of my last videos and uh, here Josie taking me to bed you know, that's where I asked uh, for opinions. That's the latest uh, video I posted. It got 23 views, as you can see up there. But if we go closer to it, and check here, 22 views, and in total, 1. Point, God damn it, 1.1 hour, uh, which means that you're watching for approximately 30 seconds each. And, you know, that's kind of sad. In my opinion in for me uh, as I'm doing this uh, there's something apparently missing people don't want to watch this uh, I can even go back to one of my most viewed videos and show the same thing essentially uh, I'm not complaining it's not that I just want to know and as I said I have uh, my Christmas tree in the way uh, but I want to know what it is I can do better to attract uh, viewers so let's see here I can't go after likes uh, yeah here can I get the Lindsay the win or not one of the uh, one of my most popular videos for obvious reasons um, because it was the finale for that sh uh, series now it has 369 views and let's see 369 14.4 hours that's not too bad though uh, I believe uh, 369 that is mm. okay that is quite bad it's 2 minutes 20 seconds uh, yeah, sure. I mean, these are adult visual novels, but what is it I'm doing wrong? Please let me know. Um, and also, if you do enjoy these videos and want me to continue to do them, you know the drill. It's up in the right corner. It's a like and a subscribe and even share the video. You know all that. But that's it for now. Uh, I enjoy this. I just want to know what I can do more to make the content better but enough of that so uh, as i mentioned in the last episode we were just on the brink should we go further with uh, sage or not uh, as i said one comment saying do what you want to do and i really do appreciate that because i am doing this first and foremost for myself i enjoy these stories i just want to share them with you and uh, but i am going to do the way i want it because 100 percent of viewers uh, of sub, uh, comments said do what you want to do and i am uh, gonna stop this because i want to stay with either maya or josie i have not decided on that yet <laughs> please stop it i just wanted to help because you returned my guitar I didn't want this. At least not like this. This whole thing is over now, right? No, not yet. Don't tell me. I want to know who the bitch is. No, wait. She's slightly high. And I need to have a more feminine voice. It's kind of difficult. Uh, I mean, it kind of depends on uh, how it's being conducted. Does this bitch know uh, that uh, Shad is together with you and is she doing this uh, 
knowing full well that she will fuck things up with you or is she doing this because she is in love with him and he's the one who doesn't have the guts to end the relationship it, depending on that answer it shows if she's a bitch or if she's just a girl that loves a, a chad <laughs> that's not a chad a chad is a good guy i believe mm. Sympathize, not talk her out of it. Why don't you just ask him? You have proof of it now. Hmm. And well, that's interesting. What what do we get if we sympathize? Because that is not the response I was expecting. I understand how you must be feeling, but please just let it go. This isn't healthy. This this is the. Uh, uh, response I was looking for. What the hell? Talk her out of it or sympathize. Why am I got the am I getting the reverse response? Am I misunderstanding something here? This isn't over until I find out who that cunt is. But as for you and me, we're even. Well, that's something. But I'm begging you, will you help me find out who it is? No. No, I don't think so. I am not getting in the middle of that. That is not my business. Not gonna happen. I did my part. I'm out. I hope you can manage to move on, Sage. Move on? Look, he made his choice already. Just accept that. I can see that you're still angry. Hey, I have a surefire way to help with that. Oh! Yes! That is awesome! Uh, okay, so... She's... Let's not turn her into a fucking fight doll, or whatever it's called. Uh, but, this is... Good exercise in general. And this shows what kind of character you are, uh, Kurt, in this case. Uh, yes, this I like. And this is how you make friends for life, essentially. Just show them bits and pieces of who you are, and they will either accept it or <laughs> not, you know. <sighs> Gah! <laughs> it's good, huh? It feels fantastic. I never trained like this. I never knew training like this was so effective. You're really good at this. Thank you. I praise a lot with my dad growing up. Not enough to beat the jocks, though. Oh, please. It's not like I'm superhuman. There are way too many of them. Besides, I don't practice fighting to use it against people. It's just for being able to defend myself or others. You mean like it's a code? Yeah, exactly. Like a code. I can understand that. Friends and sororities have codes too. So, what's the HOTS code? All HOTS are sisters. We don't turn ag against each other. Alright. That's not what it sounds like. The way Queen treats your pledges doesn't seem like sisterhood to me. Oh, come on. It's just a bit of hazing. It's no difference from what the dicks put you through. I mean, you don't have to like it. But it's a one-time thing you endure before you're one of the gang. If you don't get that, you will never become a dick. I see. Either way, that's a hot public code. Don't turn on each other. Public code? Do you mean you have a secret code too? Maybe. What is it? Would it be a secret if I told you? The dicks have codes too, but you probably knew that already. Yeah, family comes first. 
Exactly! If you're a dick, you're a brother. And much like the hearts, brothers never let their siblings down. It's a nice code. I never had any siblings to care for. Although, from what I've seen so far, that's not the impression I've gotten from dicks. So everything's pretty mean-spirited. There's a lot of things that you don't see until you start looking for them. What does that mean? Nothing. And the boo. Hey, before I forget, thank you for returning my guitar. You did the right thing. Do you play a lot? Yeah, almost daily. I almost wanted to learn how to play the guitar. I never took the initiative. Chad knew that. That's why he gave it to me. Huh. Uh. Ooh. Fucking leave Chad out of this. We need to know more about Sage. At first I thought she was just a, a hot high, hot and high, <laughs> uh, but she's way cooler than I expected. What stopped you from starting to learn? You know, excuses, procrastination, certain family members that thought I should be playing something fancier than a guitar. Fancier? Like a violin? Meh, fuck it. Will you teach me how to play it? So you want me to be your teacher? Yeah, if you want to. Sure. Sure. <laughs> really? For real? It sounds like fun. Great. Now let's set something up. Thank you for, tr for the training session. It was fun and I needed it. Anytime, Sage. And the fact that we did this right after denying her means that we're not doing this just to get in bed with her because that could have been done already. I hope that you've cooled down. So, if that is a thing, then her approval of us has increased. Time to take the showers. See you later. Oh, that was a good crack. Oh, I hope that was loud. And breathe out. Hmm, that's better doing yoga with someone. Great form, Yell. Yell. Uh, no. Knowing Bella, she's going to catch us. So don't risk it. Looks like we have ourselves a spectator. Yes, she's deadpan. Oh, me? No, I wasn't looking. Hi, Kurt. Hey, Jill. <coughs> <laughs> and hey, Bella. What the fuck was that? Like? That was a stupid cough. <laughs> Don't call me Bella. Sarah Bella. What the hell is a cerebellum? I think that's a part of the brain. Uh, hi, Isabella! Hi, Isabella! Pricing yoga? Yes, we do it a couple of times every week. It's a good way to stay in shape. And how would you know that? Yeah, no, you have to... I mean, I am doing the safe route here. That's me, safe and wholesome. And that's... Ooh, that's me. I'm safe and wholesome. <laughs> Common knowledge. Also, I've done yoga before too. Lies. I'm not lying. I'm very bendy. Then show me. Alright. I'll do that post you just did. How would you know what pose she did? You weren't watching, remember? I, uh... Go ahead, do the pose that Jill just did. See? What is this, the rising sun or something like that? You're doing it wrong. Really? 
Yes, straighten your back more. Like this. Oh wow. Yes, straighten your back, boy. Boy. <laughs> she's she's mean. <laughs> Ouch. That's better. How about this pose? You almost got it. Lift your back a bit more. No, no. Because look closer is never just to watch her pose, it's to watch her uh, figure. Focus. Don't look. Are you watching her? Yes. Looks good. Let me see you try it. Like this? What do you think, Jill? Not quite right. I agree. Straighten your legs more and try bending a bit further. She is very nice! Great! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Hi! Hi! <laughs> Isabella! Sloppy. At least you weren't lying. I see that you've done similar exercises before. I think it, I think it did great. Excuse me for a minute. I need to refill my water bottle. That woman really scares me. <laughs> oh, come on. She's not scary. She's nice. Nice? Kid is nice. That woman is no pussycat. She's more like a cheetah. That's still a feline. You two, you two seem so different. How come you're friends? We're not that different. We share a lot of common hobbies such as books, yoga and wine tasting. Does she tell you that you're drinking wine the wrong way too? <laughs> now you're the mean one. Give her a chance. I think you would see that there's much more to her than you think. I am giving her a chance, but so far I went from calling her Bella to Isabella. That's a big step backwards. You should probably not have called her Bella to begin with. It's just a name. How could that upset her? Really? It's your attitude too. I can get that. Huh. <sighs> I just want to show her that I'm thankful for the help. She knows that you're thankful. She just doesn't let people in that easily. Don't take it personally. You seem a lot uh, you seem a lot more open than her. Well, not really. Just a bit more understanding, maybe. Tie vault. <laughs> yeah! I thought that was you! Hi! Oh, hi. A panty sniffer. Such a creep. Uh, I guess hi. Hi, Tybalt. And he ignores me. Yes. I was just out running laps, you know, working on my endurance. <laughs> hint, hint. <laughs> you like running, right? Are we gonna make fun of him? I mean, she doesn't like him, we know that. Yeah, let's make fun of him. We already, we're, she already knows us being a rude and on a mean streak. I do like running, thanks for asking. Why don't you join me for a brisk jog back to the mansion? I have some excellent ideas for what that campaign you wanted to start. You do? Really? Yes, I've been thinking about it all morning. Come, I'll tell you all about it. Oh, well, alright. I gotta run. See you later, Kurt. Okay, so here's where you should start with the campaign. Okay, I definitely get it. And Snow has a crush on Jill. You don't say. 
I knew it. Knew what? You scared her off, didn't you? I knew she would say that. Oh, I didn't. She left with Tybalt. Tybalt? I don't like that guy. <laughs> we can also ask, who do you like? Uh, just go with me neither. No, me, me neither. That makes two of us. So, you're into Yil? That's none of your business. She seems to like you. Does she now? Yil is special to me. If you don't get along with me, you won't get along with her. I can assure you of that. What? Yen and I are close, and I think you're trouble. Of course you would say that. You have been against me since day one. It's not like she's your daughter or anything. Let her make her own decisions. Hmm. I know boys like you. You're only after one thing. You have no clue what I'm looking for or where I'm coming from. This is just for you. What does that mean? This is just for Jill. Then tell me. You get one chance to change my mind. Oof. Okay, can I put my safe and hold some powers to win Isabella's? Uh, not her heart, but uh, a, piece, a piece of her uh, mind. Look, I'm all sweaty. Can we do this another time? Tonight. Dinner at Luigi's. 8 p.m. Do not be late. And we have a lot of ma money now. Well, a couple of dollars anyway. Fine, it's a date. It is not a date. Maggot, where the fuck have you been? In the shower. Unless it was a golden one, I'm not interested in hearing more about that. Here, drink. Oh, I can't tonight. I'm going out for dinner. Are you refusing refusing orders, maggot? Drink. Chug, chug, chug. That's fucking right, you maggots. You're both gonna make up for that sh for what shitface over here missed out on his weekend. Going home to see your family during his first big weekend at campus. I've never been this disappointed before. Hey, I've had enough. I'm gonna be late for dinner. You've had enough when I say so. Oh, shit. So going home to see... Say hi to Dad and Josie means that I'm fucking up my chances with Isabella. And in the long run, Jill. That is amazing, actually. It really feels like they really planned this out. Drink! You don't see your maggot brother complaining, now do you? Derek? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm totally fine. <laughs> now that's how it looks when you had enough. Drink. Derek. <laughs> yeah. What time is it? Holy shit. I'm gonna be late for dinner. Derek! I'm gonna go eat dinner with the ice cream. <laughs> ice cream! Derek! Do you want some pasta from Luigi's? Bro! I got it! I need to go eat dinner with Luigi! Hey! Bella! Isabella, you're late. I'm so sorry, something came up. I'm here now. You're drunk. It's not my fault. They forced me to drink. I kept telling that I had enough, but... Whoa, that was a nasty one. I mean, I know that I didn't do it, but it was so perfect in my ears that it felt like I did it. <laughs> you know how it is. 
I can't believe that I actually wanted to give you a shot. Wait, don't, don't leave, Bella! Isabella, sorry. Bella, I... Isabella! Are you hungry? Let's eat. I'm leaving. Come on. <laughs> Whoops. Dear God, you can't even stand up straight. But I can lay flat. But I can lay down flat. Here yeah, come join me. The stars are beautiful tonight. Bella, don't go. Bella, I need you. Oh, <laughs> look, a quarter. I'm so tired. Get up. Hey, Bella. Or is it Bella Donna? Isabella, get up. You're going to get yourself arrested. Is that what you want? You're such a mess. Your eyes sparkle. Get in the car. Oh my god, you're so bossy. I'm dropping you off at the fraternity so you can sleep and sober up. Good luck with that. I'm not allowed to sleep there yet. So, where do you stay? You're driving really fast. I haven't even started the engine yet. Well, slow down! <laughs> that was fucking hilarious. Hey, it's this song. I love this song. It's my favorite song. No way, it's my dad's favorite song too! When I was young, my dad played me this song on the radio. Your breath reeks of alcohol. Thanks! <laughs> oh my god, this is so much better than American Pie. So much better. And I surprised him by learning to play it on the guitar. On his birthday, I played it for him. He said that it was the nicest gift he's ever gotten. I felt really good to hear because I can't afford to buy man something. That was a nice gesture. I fucked up at several bars though, but he didn't care. I love my dad. What? Oh, we actually. It's kind of cool that we are sober enough to choose what to do. Thank her. Thank you for the ride. I have no clue where we're going, but thanks. Did you dress up just for me? I think you did. I guess I fucked up my chance. Your chance of what? You know, about a day. Showing you that I'm thankful to you. And that I'm not the kind of guy that you think I am. You don't talk much. I talk enough. And you never smile. I do smile. No, I don't think you do. You go like this. Or like this. What's up with that? Just sit back and close your eyes for a while. I mean, even if you don't talk to people and you don't care what they're saying, having a drunk ass person just saying exactly what you're like without any kind of filter and you know that they're right, that sucks ass. Hey, this isn't the, this isn't the dick mansion. No, this is my house. It's so big. Here you go, eat this. This is very good. Did you cook this? When you're done eating, you may sleep on the couch upstairs. Good night. This food is so good. Oh. Task, go to bed. Your dick score was updated. Let's check on that, actually. Oh. I have new contacts, huh? Josie and Sage, I see. 
Uh, no. I sexy. I'm thinking about you. No. Oh no. I'm not doing that. No! I can't choose to not reply! What kind of bullshit is that? I actually... I can't even cheat my way back! My god! I can only... Oh no! <laughs> Son... Is everything all right? That wrong number. Uh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, hey, are you okay? I just saw Derek, and it got me worried about you. You're so sweet for worrying about me. Don't worry, I'm fine. Don't wait up. I really like you, my. You're so thoughtful. I'm okay. I'll be home tomorrow. Which is the better one? I think this is better because they're also leaning uh, closer to Maya that way. Oh no! Ah, okay, she did say the message first. Thanks for the help today. You really helped me release some stress. Welcome, Sage. I'll gladly help you with your stress again. Maybe you release uh, me with some release next time. No, the first one. Uh, I can I can help. Uh, what? Are you drunk or something? <gasps> no, I don't think I fucked up the other messages. Yes, I'm having a hard time typing at the moment. No, my autocorrect was off. Yes. Yes, I love. You're drunk. Shame. I was going to ask if you want to come over for some fun. Ah! Oh. True shame. Oh no, I'm very much a shake now. Well, it's not a bad thing. Mm. Now. Oh yes, it is much better already. But because my uh, Christmas tree in the way, I can't see it all. Can I do anything here? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. So how do I go? How do I go to bed? There we go. Why is the painting uh, on the wrong uh, uh, tilted? Oh. Now let's see if we can find any renders here. Furniture isn't even lined up against the wall. The photo frames all over the place. Poor Isabella. I think this one should be standing up. I'm such a sloppy woman. I thought it was a remote control on a stand. No. Any renders? No. Ah, there we go. Mm -mm. 
I was saying she spotted it, it's, it's all cemented. <laughs> no, we can't fuck up the, the other picture then. Uh, so let's see here. Ole de Ole Dov, Kinkelanekov. Ole de Ole Dov, Kinkelanekov. No, I don't remember how the rest of that, that thing goes. Oh my god, that's so bad. Ole de Ole Dov, Kinkelanekov. Pinky Barney. <laughs> I don't know. Let's do this. Oh, not yet. Oh, okay, so I chose the right room right away. Hmm. Oh my god, that's Bella. I can't look at her when she's in the bathroom. Don't be. Yes, here we should have a render or two. Coffee bone. Nah, I don't know. God damn it. Okay, so where's the render? There's a render here. That's a lot of books. And they weren't even in alphabetical order. She is a librarian. Ay. Any renders? No renders that I can see. Ooh. Whoa, that's an amazing mask. I wonder if it fits. No, I shouldn't try it on. Did she say upstairs though? I have to ask her. Yeah, that's ultimately super terrifying. Ah! What are you doing here? An intruder, I must do something. Don't hurt me, I'm leaving. Hey. Didn't I fix this one already? How can she live like this? What the fuck? Let's just go to sleep. Uh, this door is locked. Did I tell you to sleep downstairs or did I say upstairs on the couch? I can't find upstairs. Have you seen staircases before? That one over there w would likely be the one you're looking for. I found the couch, Isabella! I found it! There, go to sleep. We'll talk in the morning. It was so beautiful. You're still drunk. I'm not wrong though. I can't sleep. Where am I? Bella? I'm naked. Damn, my hair. It's spinning. Oh, oh shit, you started me. Are you okay? I'm a bit thirsty. I put some water right next to you. Thank you. I think he's sobering up now. Are you starting to sober up? I think so. Well, you seem to able to. Well, you seem to be able to actually answer questions now, without breathing close to my face, so you shouldn't be far off. Oh crap! I'm sorry. Yeah, you're sorry. You seem to catch me at my worst every time. If I'm not drunk, I'm naked, or both. You undressed me, so shut up. <laughs> Whips. Yeah, you're not sober yet. You know, I was forced to drink tonight. It's part of the hazing they put us through. Even with peer pressure, there's always a choice. Then you haven't met Tommy. Anyway, I didn't mean to ruin our date. Not date, dinner, not date. You sure do like to, cor you sure do like correcting me. It's just beyond comprehension that, that you refuse to listen to what I say. What? That was not the idea! Oh no, why did you do that? What the hell is this boy doing? 
I have never been this. This. No, this does not, not, does not compute. What the hell? Did he just go in for a kiss? I did. I'm kissing Bella, and she's kissing me back. She even has her band between my, her band. She even has her hand between my legs, and slightly grazing my cock with her fingers. I don't even know what I'm doing. This must be a drunken dream. Yeah, it better be. Please be a dream. If it is a dream, maybe she let me touch her boobs. Oh my god, that's so fucking big. Oh. I just can. Not with a young student. Not with anyone. Fuck that, snap out of it. This didn't happen. You're still drunk. Are you sure? Kurt, I'm a married woman. Go to sleep. Damn. So close. <laughs> Why did he? I don't understand. I feel so... So dirty. This is not what a married woman does. I'm so sorry. He just caught me completely off guard. How long has it been since a man did this to me? Three years? Dude, try ten years. No, that can't be right. I haven't got an urge to touch myself. That's all. Until tonight. Yes, for a little bit. We did not... I don't think we needed that. Oh, wow. Now I remember. Wow! Why, why am I getting this cutscene? Oh my lord. Oh god, I can't believe they took a drunken college idiot to get me going again. That moronic boy. Kurt. Oh, I can't be thinking about Kurt. Take it slow, Kurt. Wow. She looks very different, and I like it. But that is where we're cutting off for today's episode. Uh, thank you for watching, and you know, we, I want, I am really curious to see where we're going from here. Is Isabella going to like us more, or like us less, because of the way we are acting? And I really want to explore her house a bit more. I think that that random dude was a photo of her late husband or something like that. Um, yeah. So what is Jill and Bella's relationship then? I thought they were a couple, but they could be adopt adoptees and that and adoptee, I guess. Uh, yeah, well, that's it for today. As I said, um, have a nice day, everyone. And remember, just because you're not the main character doesn't mean you're not important. Goodbye, everyone.